Welcome back to our discussion on design of uh, talents for uh, genome editing. So, in the uh, last uh, part, we discussed about some of the assembly methods which is used for tail based fusion protein engineering like detail, flash ICA, do it yourself protocol and star. Uh, today, we will uh, discuss about some of the computational tools that I used uh, in this uh, entire process and uh, as well as for uh, other uh, requirements uh, for uh, talent uh, researchers. Tal effector design is a complex uh, procedure as there are various considerations to be followed as below and some of them are already known to you uh, due to the discussions uh, in, in some of the uh, uh, slides earlier. So, one of the requirements is uh, thymine has to precede the DNA target sequence. The requirement of uh, talents to target uh, paired sites within defined range of distances uh, apart on opposing strands, uh, differential contributions of different repeat types to overall activity and a polarity to mismatch uh, tolerance are, are required. Uh, to meet the various challenges uh, as listed above, uh, several computational tools have been developed to aid in the design assembly and off target uh, prediction. So, we can look into these various type of uh, computational tools uh, from uh, three uh, broad uh, divisions. Uh, the first division being the uh, softwares which are being used for TAL effector design and uh, examples are TAL effector targeter, a TAL plasmid sequence assembly tool. The second type being TAL effector target uh, prediction. So, here we have softwares or computational tools like target finder, then TAL wedge and TAL getter. The third type is the talent design and off target uh, prediction. So, here we have uh, the talent targeter a paired target finder, Mojohan, eTalent, SAPTA, uh, talent offer and prognos. Uh, we will not discuss each and every of these uh, methods, uh, but we will try to discuss uh, at least one or two under each, each type uh, as, as listed in these three broad uh, categories. So, about uh, let us uh, go into uh, the discussion uh, of TAL effector uh, first. So, this is available uh, both as an open software and also as a downloadable program uh, and it is a uh, web based interface option is also there and this is part of the TAL effector nucleotide targeter suite ok, this talent suite and uh, you can uh, log into this uh, by this uh, web link as listed over here. So, when you log into this page, you will find a lot of details about the various uh, softwares available uh, in these uh, platform and then uh, there is one section uh, called uh, resources. So, here you will find uh, the various resources available under this uh, talent uh, suite as well as uh, the softwares part will also uh, list all those various uh, tools available. And then if you have certain queries, you can go to the facts uh, section as usual in all cases of uh, websites. The best thing is you have tutorials uh, for, through which you can learn uh, the uh, uses of these uh, particular tool. And these are freely available tools for designing pairs of TAL effectors for TAL uh, effector nucleases to target a specific uh, uh, gene sequences and additionally they are many things this provides to design single tal effectors to bind to a DNA sequence and to identify binding sites in a DNA sequence for a given uh, tal effector. So, this is the uh, tutorial uh, site uh, I was speaking about, uh, how to use these tools, the different uh, tools here, the talent targeter tutorial, the tal effector targeter tutorial and so on and uh, so forth. And then you have the tutorials for the older versions of the tools 
So, if you uh, have some of the old softwares downloaded and you can uh, get the tutorials in, in this particular linkage. This uh, resource pages uh, includes a spreadsheet uh, with sequences of plasmids used in the Golden Gate assembly method published by the authors and also links to the reagents and protocols for that uh, particular method. The tal effector targeter can be used to design repeat arrays uh, to specific target uh, DNA sequences. The tal effector targeter accepts target DNA sequences in uh, faster format uh, as in many bioinformatics uh, tools and software or, or, or web interfaces and uh, uh, the input can be fed either by pasting the sequence into a text box on the page or uploading an already uh, prepared file. Uh, in this particular uh, platform, the users have the freedom uh, to specify a minimum and maximum length for designed arrays and they can choose whether to allow thymine uh, default or cytosine observed in at least one native target or either on the 5 prime end and select if they want to use the RVD NH to target guanine or uh, for greater specificity or NN for better affinity. Uh, in the default settings, uh, tal effector targeter provides output RVD sequences for target sites that conform to several base composition rules uh, throughout to increase tal effector affinity. However, these restrictions can be disabled uh, through seg boxes on the uh, program page. The tal effector targeter has the ability to assess the specificity of design tal effectors by predicting binding sites in the intended targeted sequence. The preloaded genomes, promoter sets, NCBI IDs are accepted. This uses the target finder tool with a uh, uh, 3x score cutoff. The inbuilt uh, optimizations enabled by batch processing allows tal effector targeter to count binding sites for several tal effector quicker uh, than if tal finder were run for each effector. The results are summarized in the output as the number of sites found for each tal effector so that the most specific ones are uh, readily uh, apparent. Uh, the output from tal effector targeter is a tab delimited text file which is suitable for import into spreadsheet programs uh, that is also displayed as a table on the website. So, each row of the table provides a tal effector with the following details under columns. Uh, it will give the name of the target sequence, the start position of the tal effector in the target sequence, the length of the repeat array, a space separated list uh, of the RVDs which strand of the target the array is designed to bind and the plus strand sequence of the target including the 5 prime uh, T, of, T, by, or T oblique C. Let us now discuss about the tal plasmids sequence assembly tool. Uh, Baulem at uh, Georgia Institute of Technology developed uh, the, this web based utility called tal plasmid sequence assembly tool. Uh, it generates the plasmid sequences needed to make tal effector constructs using any of the several different assembly uh, methods. Input is accepted either as a target site uh, or an RVD sequence in faster format. Uh, users can select uh, from the golden Glit gate flash and ICA assembly method. So, we have discussed about uh, these methods uh, in detail or briefly uh, in the earlier part. For the golden gate assembly method users can select uh, which destination vector they would use like to use and here you have links to the adgene pages for each vector at the bottom of the page and whether to use the RVD, uh, NK, NN or NH uh, to target glutamine. The output for plasmid construct is provided in both faster format and as an annotated uh, gene bank file. The site also provides an additional handy tool that can perform an alignment of sequencing reads to the destination vector to confirm that cloning was uh, successful. So, this is the laboratory of uh, biomolecular engineering and uh, nanomedicine 
and you have here Gang Bao as the uh, principal investigator. This is the Tal Design and Analyze, Analysis Group. You can visit this site. Uh, you can get into the resources site to know what else is available as well as the softwares and then the tutorial part uh, through which you can uh, learn uh, many of the applications and various uh, fundamental basic questions are already answered in these uh, facts. And uh, this is the website uh, bowerize.edu research bioinformatics tool assemble tal sequences or there is a sort uh, bitly uh, address as well through which you can log into these uh, particular websites. So, let us uh, show uh, some examples uh, of these uh, particular uh, application uh, to generate uh, plasmid uh, sequences. So, you can enter RVDs for the TALs here or you can enter desired TAL targets uh, in, in a faster format. Okay, then you have uh, uh, the assembly method which you can choose. You can use uh, golden gate, you can use flash, you can use ICA and then uh, if you click into this drop down menu, you can get many of the destination vectors which you can use uh, for your uh, purpose. And then uh, this is the uh, uh, you can use these options for the default guanosin RVD, uh, either of these. So, in this case the NN uh, has been used and then you can generate the sequences and you can see here the faster plasmid uh, construct uh, sequence. So, uh, in a way this is quite uh, uh, simple. So, uh, this has a quick alignment tool. Uh, which generate alignments of sequencing reads to uh, individual uh, uh, vectors as well. And you can see here the uh, sequence alignment uh, taking place. And uh, we have various options uh, which you can choose as per your requirement uh, in, in this entire uh, design. So, the destination vectors uh, which uh, you, you, you can see here, uh, right. This, uh, this is the list of the destination vectors at your disposal under this uh, software, so many of them. So, and you have uh, the description over here, for example, PTAL1 is a TAL effector with natural bacterial activator domain, and PTAL2 is a uh, natural. Uh, PTL bacterial activator domain with no stop uh, cologne. Then you have uh, certain uh, plasmids like Sangamo, uh, which is a mammalian expression talent with trisex flex stack, and you have many such vectors which are useful for mammalian expression, and you can use them uh, for uh, animal experimentation. Then uh, even uh, Bricks uh, at all. Uh, this is the plasmid name as talon, and this is the mammalian expression uh, talon. And uh, this is the link uh, of the adgene repository. So, if you click into these uh, blue uh, highlighted links, you can land up in the particular page and you can find out the details and you can uh, an availability and how to order them. Let us now discuss another uh, such tool which is the uh, TAL getter. Uh, the TAL getter allows users uh, to scan input DNA sequences for putative target sites of a given TAL effector uh, as typically expressed by uh, Gentomonas. Uh, TAL getter is based on a local mixture model, uh, which assumes that the nucleotide at each position of a putative target site may either be determined by the binding specificity of the RVD at that position, or uh, if interaction occurs at that position, or by the genomic context if no interaction takes uh, place. 
The binding specificities and importance of the individual RVDs has been trained on known tal effector target site pairs. The nucleotide preferences of the genomic context are learned from promoter sequences of Arbidopsis saliana and Oriza sativa. Targeter is available as a public web server um, in this uh, web link. A web application can be installed in uh, local server, Galaxy server and as a, a common line uh, program uh, as well. And uh, as in the case of others, the input sequences must be fed in uh, FASTA format which is a standard and uh, either it can be uploaded as a file uh, or uh, um, in, in the tax section get data or uh, of Galaxy or directly pasted into the supplied uh, input field. Uh, sequence of the RVDs of the tal effectors must be given in one letter AS codes where uh, these uh, star asterisk indicates a deletion uh, in the AS sequence of the repeat. Individual RVDs must be separated by minus signs. For example, the sequence of the tal effector uh, tal C would be given as NS, then this is the minus sign NG, minus sign NS uh, and, and so on. And then uh, this star shows a deletion. Okay. So, uh, these are very important uh, points to remember to get the tool uh, working for us in designing uh, effective uh, tal effectors. So, here as uh, we were telling uh, uh, that you uh, have the Galaxy website where you uh, uh, work under the section uh, get data. So, you, you can give the job name here, okay? you just name it uh, as per your convenience. Then uh, this is the input sequence uh, where you can uh, uh, upload these in the first uh, uh, file format and then uh, or you can paste it also as well. And these are with the sequence uh, which we are referring to uh, here including the minus signs as well as the star marks or asterisk marks. Uh, this has to be defined over here. So, it is written of course, uh, sequence of RBDs separated by the dash or minus sign. So, you can have upstream offset, you can have downstream offset and maximum number of target sites as well you can define and some computational p values can also be uh, defined. So, you can visit this uh, by uh, visiting this website and practice on your own. Uh, taking any of the targets of your uh, choice and uh, design some of the uh, tail, uh, uh, I mean domains. Uh, this target model can also be uh, trained on users own training data. So, this has been originally trained in uh, with uh, data from Arabidopsis thaliana and uh, Oriza sativa as uh, I have told you earlier, but uh, you can also train it on your own data that is pairs of tal effector DVD sequences and the target size. But to do this uh, as a user, you have to set the parameter uh, model training, change it to train model on training data and provide the training data in annotated faster format. Okay. So, changing uh, the param, uh, set parameter from model training to train model on training data is important uh, for training uh, on, on, on the user's data and which has to be provided as annotated uh, faster uh, format. And uh, uh, if you are a user of these uh, particular tool. Uh, uh, it is being uh, requested to cite the developers uh, uh, in, in, in this citation uh, as I have listed over here and published in uh, PLOS Computational Biology in the year 
2013. So, okay, another tool that is available is eTalent uh, which is available in the website uh, www.etalent.org. This is an online tool which streamlines the process of designing talents for specific locations within genes for multiple purposes. Although it can also design talents for generic sequences. The web interface offers users uh, various opportunities like uh, selecting from several model genomes, provide ensemble accession numbers for up to 50 genes they want to target, choose whether they want to do a gene knockout, 5 prime sequence replacement for N terminal tagging or a 3 prime one for C terminal tagging and choose a preferred assembly uh, kit. Optimization parameters are available uh, to customize nearly every part of the process and restriction enzyme site analysis is also uh, available. Based on the user's input, the tool automatically designs and screens possible talent designs based on best location within the gene for the Susan task and uniqueness to the intended target. One unique feature of eTalent is the ability to check for off targets simultaneously uh, in the target genome which is absent in other tools and allows for any repair, replacement or insertion sequences to be introduced as part of the experiment. The output of eTalent is available as a web report and as downloadable tab delimited text and GFF uh, tree files. Uh, for an output talent, uh, the strand binding site nucleotide sequence, exons hit, RVD sequences and a score based on length and compositional variance, uh, if the higher uh, value is more it is better uh, are obtained. The web report includes uh, also statistics regarding the number of possible talent designs filtered out due to its design criterion and a summary graphic showing the targeted gene and the location of target sites for the output uh, talents and these are not these are unique uh, to this uh, particular uh, program. So, thank you uh, for your listened uh, he uh, patient hearing. Mm -hmm.